This is After Effects and uh, let's import the Snow FG footage here which we had saved in 3ds Max and now import the background image too. Drag the Snow FG here and Snow BG2. If you zoom in, you will find here some uh, edges problem. We can amend that. For that, right click on the Snow FG footage, go to Interpret Footage and here click on Pre-Multiplied Matted with Color. Okay, and now you won't find the black edges problem here. Now after that, the first thing we will do is to decrease the color intensity of the background footage. So with the snow BG layer selected, go to effect color correction and apply tint effect and reduce the tint amount, maybe 55, fine. And now apply one more effect and that would be Gaussian blur increase the blurriness something like this now it looks quite out of focus and gives a perfect look of uh, depth of field now before I apply any more effect on a snow FG layer I would pre-compose that so with the snow FG layer selected go to layer and click on pre-compose and here select move all attributes into the new comp and press ok now if you double click on this the original layer opens here in a separate comp. This is with the Snow FG layer only. Now make an adjustment layer here. Scale it up a bit. And now apply the Gaussian blur onto this. And the blurriness value could be 5. It's fine. Now pick the pen tool and draw a mask something like this once done open the mask property and make it inverted and increase the mask feather something like this why did I do that because it makes the middle portion of the image more focused now come to our final comp and you will see a great depth of field effect here the middle part of the snow FG layer is in focus while the rest of the part is blurred and out of focus. Now let's apply one more effect. Go to effect, color correction and uh, tint and uh, make it 30. It looks quite good now. Now we can add some grains in the final image. So create an adjustment layer here and um, apply the add grain effect this effect looks good in a moving uh, or animated footage you can do so if you want to so guys i hope you have enjoyed this tutorial and must have learned some tips and tricks today so see you again in my next tutorial this is Chandan Kumar from India for CG Tutes Plus exclusively. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.